taking GIS data into the field with Global Mapper Mobile. A map for field work in Global Mapper Mobile is started in Global Mapper Desktop. Relevant data is loaded and styled before exporting the map to a Global Mapper Mobile package file. With a Global Mapper Mobile package transferred to a mobile device, this file can be opened directly through the Global Mapper Mobile app. Just like Global Mapper Desktop, Global Mapper Mobile contains a control center that lists the layers present in the map and allows users to hide and reorder the layers. From the Location Display menu, enabling GPS display will by default use the internal location services of the mobile device to display the GPS location on the map and note the coordinate location and accuracy on screen. Vector features can be searched by enabling the search tool from the toolbox on the bottom of the screen. To search, an attribute is selected from the top half of the screen and a value is selected from the bottom. The features matching the search criteria will be identified on the map. A long tap gesture anywhere on the map will launch the device camera to allow an image to be captured and linked to the map at the GPS location. Vector features can be created in Global Mapper Mobile using the point, line, or area digitizer create modes. Each feature type contains options to manually draw the feature on the map or record the feature based on the GPS location information. After completing the geometry of a feature, attributes can be entered or added on the new feature screen. When field data collection and editing is complete, save and export the map. With the saved map file transferred back to Global Mapper, the edited and analyzed data can be further explored. To learn more about Global Mapper Mobile, read the blog on this topic available at bluemarblegeo.com and download the app for free from the iOS App Store or Google Play Store. If you're considering Global Mapper, download a free trial today.